Some of the world's most famous glaciers will disappear by 2050 due to global heating, no matter what the temperature rise scenario is. That's according to the UN, which has published a new report outlining the fate of glaciers in Kilimanjaro and other UNESCO World Heritage Sites. These are mainly sites with a small uh, glacierized uh, area, uh, but these include, for instance, the last remaining glaciers uh, in, in Africa, Mount Kilimanjaro, the Ruwenzori uh, Mountains, but also some other iconic uh, uh, glaciers, such as the Dolomites uh, here in Italy, as well as uh, Yosemite Park and Yellowstone uh, in uh, the United States. Um, by, by 2100, around half of glaciers in World Heritage Sites could disappear in a business-as-usual scenario. UNESCO monitors around 18,600 glaciers across 50 of its World Heritage Sites. And those glaciers lose around 58 billion tons of ice every year on average. That's equivalent to the total annual volume of water used in France and Spain combined and contributes to almost 5% of the global observed sea level rise. But there's a way to prevent this. I would say that the main action that needs to be taken to counteract glacier retreat is really to re drastically reduce emissions, carbon emissions. Um, what happens uh, also is that uh, even if we stop uh, emissions as of today, these glaciers have uh, inertia, no? uh, in the sense that changes will keep happening. And we will definitely need uh, measures at site level to adapt, to adapt to these changes. The remaining two-thirds of World Heritage glaciers can be saved, but only if the world limits global heating to one and a half degree. This report is a call to action, and scientists hope the COP27 summit will play a crucial role to help find solutions fast. Ida Maksud, TRT World.